Binghamton's women's lacrosse team is making history and breaking records this season. And the team is less than 24 hours away from notching another historic first in the record books for the university. 12 News and Sports' Zach Grady spends some time this week with the Bearcats as they get ready to face off in the NCAA National Championships. May 5, 2024 was a day of many firsts for the Binghamton Bearcats women's lacrosse team. The morning began in New York's capital, defeating SUNY rival U Albany for the first time in program history. My class really fully just wanted to come in and win, so beating the Great Danes was always a huge challenge for us, and winning today against them meant a little more than just the America East title, it was beating the Danes for the first time. The win capturing the university's first America East Conference Championship in school history. We're very excited just to be here and, you know, keep going, keep playing another day, especially as a senior. Um, just getting another game is good, and we want to keep playing as long as we can. With it, locking up the school's first NCAA tournament berth. Incredibly proud of this program and this team. Uh, it's been a long time in the making, and I think the senior class especially has been a huge part. Bearcats broke school records once again in 2024, most of which they set just one year ago. The 12 wins is the most in school history, as well as the most consecutive wins, eight, which the team could extend to nine with a win in the first round of the NCAA tournament Friday against Yale. We've been in high-pressure situations. We're used to it, but we know that if we play our game, like, we can come out on top. We can beat any team. Like, it doesn't matter what team we're facing, just playing our game, sticking to what we know. The 2024 Bearcats team includes seven all-conference selections. Senior midfielder Kristen Scheidel, junior attacker Olivia Muscolino, and junior defender Angelina Swow receiving first-team honors. It's definitely unreal. You know, I coach a lot of uh, little kids back at home, so... Uh, having been one of those girls one day and looking up to seeing how far that I've come and how far that a lot of my friends have come, having played lacrosse for so many years, it's really unbelievable and it's probably one of the biggest things that I've been able to accomplish here. Joining them on the America East Conference second team are seniors attacker Madison Murphy and midfielder Haley Weltner. Our offense works and it's not just seven threats on the field or even two. We're lucky enough to have depth on our field and we have nine players that can go in at any time and maybe someone's having an off day or someone's having a hard defender on them and they're able to step up and score for us and produce. Freshman Emma Blashmi and Mia Forte were also both named to the AE All-Rookie team. Blashmi led the Bearcats with four goals in the America East Championship win over the Danes. The Bearcats now head to New Haven, home of the sixth overall ranked and the team's first round opponent, Yale Bulldogs. We, we know that we have to rise to the occasion. We're playing with the best of the best. Um, but fortunately for us, we, we've had some um, challenges and overcome them over the course of the season. So I think we're ready for this next one. The energy and excitement is like really fueling us. I mean, taking that and to putting it into our workout on the field. I think like we know what we're doing. We can do it. We just got to do it. The Bearcats and Bulldogs face off Friday at 1 p.m. Zach Grady, 12 Sports, Broome County.